Hey guys, I'm Rosalvain and welcome back to another part of Final Fantasy X. Where we last left off was that, uh, yeah, we were about to fight the dragon, but uh, by all due respect, I didn't know how to beat the dragon, and so I kind of went off on a tangent to uh, train my characters. And I also took like a huge hiatus from the last episode, so sorry for the delay again. Um, I did train my character, of course. You can see the lineup here. Um, the lineup right now so far is that I, <laughs> I basically trained Kamari up to level 20. Because there was a reason why this happens, uh, due to, <clears throat> due to, due to something I saw, based on it. No, I'm not moving here. Uh, move probably around here. Yes. Um, but yeah, I saw something online. Like I was looking to see how to, like, hurt the dragon. I guess I would say. Um, due to like what I saw. Uh, I was like, okay, so I might need somebody who can damage the the dragon from afar or something. Um, I can't remember exactly what I wanted to do planned wise. I know I want to get down to here to get the other uh, particular spheres. I realized that just now. Um, I guess I'll move here for now. Yes. Use Monosphere, I guess. So he's gonna probably have like Kamari's gonna probably have some magic stuff going on. So yeah, basically this is what I had in mind, I think, with with in terms of training Kamari. Um, I'll keep moving. I'll move downwards. I'll skip out the. I'll skip out on on the stuff up here. I think for now, even though I shouldn't be, but no, no, not move. Use. Powers here. Um, yeah, so that's gonna be that. Unless you're there. Use your speed sphere. Yeah, so, yeah, that's what it is exactly so far. I've been trying to get this game going for a while now, but it's just. It's been pretty tiresome because of, like, how much there's so. Like, there's so much still to manage, or so much stuff still to do. Um, mana. But yeah, I got a lot of spheres due to, uh,. Just training, I guess. And then, if you saw earlier, like if you pause the video a little bit earlier, technically you can probably see like I have a bunch of gills on me. I actually haven't bought anything for a long time, and I've been wanting to, but it's just it's been difficult because there was no shop on the on the uh, ship, so I can't sell anything or buy anything. So whatever I got now is whatever I got so far. Um, moving over to. Probably this one. Yes, I kind of over, I over, or I kind of under th thunk it, <laughs> overthought it about like moving my stuff. I need one more level to make it move properly. I think I miscounted it because I was counting to see how much levels I needed, but apparently I was off by a little bit. It seems. Yes, I'm off by lo one level probably, so that's fine. Lizera and uh, Fire, I think. Thundera. Okay. What's next door? Thundera and Watera and Fyra's at the bottom. Okay, that's totally fine. Um, let's go in power of Li uh, Titus. I was gonna say Linus for some reason. Uh, go down here. Yes. Use the speed sphere. Yeah. So I'm trying to power up everything. I know it's annoying. Like this is like every time when I'm like away for too long from the series, from this particular series, that I end up like. No, no, not use. Move. Uh, here. Yes. Like, every time I go away for a series and grind like crazy, I end up coming back just spending so much time just upgrading versus, like, actually, like, doing the game, like, playing some games, playing the game and getting further on with the, uh, with the game. Yes. Use the power sphere for this. I'm gonna have to use the power sphere for the health. I mean, Oron so far has been really, like, powerful so far. He's been way too, like, strong for any fights, basically. Um, I did look further a little bit ahead, and it seems a little bit further ahead of the, uh, of the skill tree that Oron has, and it seems like he's almost at the end of it, and that he needs to probably eventually, uh, 
move on to doing somebody else's skill tree or something. Yeah, because when I reach here, I'm not going to have much to do. Because there's a level 3 key and a level f another level 4 key blocking the way of following towards, I think, Titus's skill tree, I think. But anyways, that seems to be the case here so far. Um, I do want to move over here in this little corner to get to uh, Demi. Yeah, let me move over here. I know it might be a risk doing this, but we'll see. We'll see what happens. Yeah, so I wanted to use. I wanted to get that. Get the power sphere. Get some defense points out of the way. And some strength, and then move back towards this area. So we would move a little bit closer to. Yes, we would move a little bit closer to the Agas. I would call it. The Agas are like the Thundergas and Firegas, because those are the ones that kind of like... Those are the ones that kind of deal the most damage with Lulu, I think. Yes. Use. So all the ability series will be towards the Agas, because I kind of wanted the Agas for a while now, but just never got to it because I haven't leveled her up to the point where she can move towards them. So that's all the Agas gone and out of the way, but I still also need the power speed to get that one. She has two more moves, so I can probably move towards something else. Um, no, I wanted to see- ugh, god dang it, I wanted- ah, whatever, I'll move upwards maybe, I guess, and then use the Monosphere. Yeah, I wanted to see what it was that, that I'm getting. Because I want to get more mana, uh, or magic points, because that would give her a little bit more damage. Oh yeah, death. Oh yeah, I wanted to, do, to get death, but that's going to be a little bit of time. No, not yet. Um, there's still Riku, which apparently I didn't... Like, for Riku, it seems so far that her skill tree is pretty okay, I guess. She isn't, like, much, I would say. She doesn't have much to go on, apparently. It's really weird, because I thought that she had a lot, but she didn't really have a lot, to be honest. Um, so once I get to her, like, other stuff, I guess, she kind of has something. Uh, mana. Like, she doesn't have much after a bit, I think. Yes. Use it on speed. Yeah, she doesn't have much. It's the weirder thing. It's like, Riku doesn't have much to move on for the trees. So, yeah, it ends up being like she has more, almost an empty tree, I guess. A very empty sphere grid area. Which is fine, I mean, but it's just not enough, I would say. Not enough things coming into it. Oh, copycat. What the heck does copycat do? I wonder. Alright, and then lastly, I think is Waka. I think we didn't do Waka yet. Um... I want to move in here and then come back out because I actually don't know. I don't know what's expected in this little skill area, so I'm just gonna get whatever I can. Plus, it gives it. It's good to get him a little bit of strength over here. Um, where is he going next? Oh, jeez, where? Did, what the heck? <laughs> this just moved me away from where I was supposed to be at. He just threw me off. God damn it! All right, let's see. I wanted to see what was down here. Okay, I already got through that. Bought the two of them. Oh, it's okay. So the continuation is here. Okay, never mind. I I was I wasn't looking at it, it properly. I think yes, I didn't see it properly, so I didn't realize that the uh, that this thing keeps going from here. Power, mana. So that's magic. Should I use love one sphere? No, no, no. I want to use love one sphere. I think. No, I don't want to use- I don't want to- I want to save the black magic, but I do want to use the level here because this one doesn't actually do anything much. Like, it's- it doesn't give a lot to, uh... No, no, no. Use? No. Speed. Yes. It doesn't- Like, level ones don't usually, like, block anyways. It just blocks, like, little small tree spec sections, but... Technically, it's not supposed to block anything much besides, like, smaller sub parts of the branch I guess like some of the smaller branches stuff 
but overall it's not much, I would say. Speed Sphere. Use the Ability Sphere. Silence Buster, that's cool. Uh, move up to here. Yes. Use Speed, Mana, whatever. Yeah, so basically that's all I got so far, I would say. Um, oh, oops. I forgot we already used all the moves from Waka's side. Forgot about it. Alright. Uh, yes. So we should be able to fight the dragon. I'm gonna save over a very old save, probably. Um, like, look at this. <laughs> 8, 8 17. So that's like last year in August. And currently we're in May of 2018. So it's funny how it was like long ago where, uh, it was long ago where I was like, uh, I was like, uh, doing the saving or no we were heading over to basically uh riku's place like riku's like base or home base basically so let's go into this again we already uh done this kind of like intro part i think we tried two times i think in the last episode if i recalled but we were in the middle of fighting a dragon while we're in an airship that's flying towards yuna's wedding or quote unquote quote unquote wedding but it's actually her kidnap i think uh Oh, you're the one who sells some stuff. Okay, got any weapons? I actually want to sell some stuff. I actually bought... I already got too much stuff. Yes. I actually have too much stuff on me. There's this shop that I needed. Um... I preferably want more... stuff... out of it. Yeah, it has a comparison thing. Uh, red bangle... No, magic bangle is still better. Magic Mangle is still better. Distill ability. Sheep, sleep touch. <sighs> Seeker's arm guard. Oh, this is better. Okay, Waka's gonna get something better. Silence touch. No, because I know I'm not gonna hit. Uh, no, I'm gonna sell that. Sell that. Yeah, I had a lot of fights against like certain... Like, like certain like creatures so I kind of like had a lot more no I'm gonna sell that lucid targe no don't want that muted sword I might switch out the the flame tongue on Titus's end frost blade no hot knuckles no Yes, Seeker's Arm Guard is better than uh, the stuff that's equipped, which is... Oh, this is Waka's. Okay, so that's... Okay, A-Blade. A-Blade. <laughs> I got... I was like, when I saw A-Blade when I, when I first got it, I was like, A-Blade? What the heck? A-Blade? No, don't want that. Thunderball... No. Flame Tongue I already got, so that's not needed. Alright, let me go up into the seekers this one i can sell i think yeah because i don't need more mp on that a claw again a claw all right magic bangle no yeah i had a lot of fire ones because the firebomb guys were all over the place i'm probably gonna keep this but upgrade the strength on the daydreamer might be I'm gonna sell that anyways. Seeker's arm guard. So I got two of these duplicates. I got a duplicate, so that's fine. But yeah, that's probably what it is so far. Um, Thank you. Let me actually. Oh, not that pause. <laughs> I got used to the pause kind of thing. Wait, did Oren just? Wait, why does Oren have one more sphere level up? What the heck? Did I not move the last one? Jesus. Why did I not move that? That was weird of me. Alright, that should be good. Uh, yes. Now back to equipment. I wanted to go to equipment. There we go. It was Waka who had the Seekers thing. It seems like it's an upgraded version of it. Is there a thing I can upgrade? No, I'm, well, actually I can. This is for Riku's ability or attacks. 
what is the thing for strength? It's power spheres? Double AP. Whoa. Double AP? Ability points? That is actually gonna be good for... But we don't have Mega Elixir or Mega Elixir, but we we do have other stuff, I guess. Um, I mean, I can do this, but that's it. Like that's the only time I can ever do that. Sensor piercing. No, do no more damage to armored enemies. Eh. Yeah, I was trying to think about putting in the strength to see if it was better, but it looks like it's not going to be better unless I have to make elixir. I'm gonna hold hold on to the daydreamer. Yeah, I thought I had plus five or plus ten strength, but let me see what equipment does Titus have. Flame tongue plus five strength. Yeah, I don't have plus five. That's the problem, and Riku doesn't know how to like equip I think equip the plus plus five yet all right let me over save uh, this one yes alrighty all right guys so that should be that I'm sorry I'm still preparing for the fight because I want to be careful with this fight due to uh, due to other things I guess okay, got any items I kind of Wait, what? What is this? What's a power distiller? What? What? A map? Displays the world map. Why? Oh, it makes one end. Okay, see, so that's useless to me. Yeah, I only got three. Then why did it say... N so the double AP, it doesn't count because... It takes Mega Elixir, but it doesn't have a certain amount that needs to be... Like, they don't know what the amount is for that. Okay, that's... Weird. Thank you. Rinze. I want to see what weapons you actually got. I actually haven't checked out in a long time ever. Plus 5 and Fire Strike. Baroque. Yeah, so this is the plus 5, but I don't have... I would love to put double AP on this, rather, but... No. Uh, Yuna's not even on the ship with us right now. She's actually away somewhere else. Hit switcher. Yeah, I already did that. The hit switch hitter, I think it said. Yeah, switch hitter. And then variable mog. I already put in, like, stuff. And it's the one I have better. The one I have is better. Shimmering blade. I. It's the same thing. Devastator. No. Seeker. Seeker shield actually has more HP, but I'll take it, I guess. Yes. Yes. Seeker's Ring, that's fine already. Seeker's Arm Guard, I just got I just got one, but it doesn't have a second it doesn't have a second slot ability thing. So I might purchase this. I do have a lot of money. I have two hundred and two hundred and two hundred one thousand <laughs> gills. I by all means I don't know how I got that to be honest, but equipment will reduce current MP pros proceed. Yeah, I don't mind that. Um, I think more HP at the moment is what I need. Iran is magic defense is fine. I'll keep the magic defense. All right. Um, let me Thank go you. and. Yo. Oh, not pause. I keep pausing myself. Let me go and change the equipment here or customize the equipment i'm sorry if i'm taking too much time on this but i'm just trying to get as much as as much good as i can oh there's a 20 percent oh i see i had to put elixir in there ah, that's very very risky automatically uses phoenix down on okay that's cool to have but how much three mega elixirs is what i need or more some some amount of elixirs i need so I don't know. Uh, maybe more HP, but then that takes away a bit of my elixir, which I want to keep. I can use more defense. Metal shield. Seeker shield became metal shield, which is weird. 
Okay, I guess. Um, and Seeker's Arm Guard that Waka has will have... Magic Defense, maybe? Pearl Arm Guard. Ooh, they changed names. Interesting. Seeker's Bangle will become... Stone Ward. Petrification. Yeah, sure. It became a soft bangle. <laughs> Alright, and then last but not least, uh, Kamari's thing will be... Magic Defense. No, Defense. Becomes a Metal Armlet. Nice. Daydreamer will just do whatever it does. Um, and then Muted Sword. I'm holding on to it for now because I want to later on have... Auto, please. I want to get Muted Sword to... Wait, what was that? I just saw something else. Now I want to see what the heck is Brotherhood. Um, was it equipped? Wait, why did I... What? Why did I switch out Brotherhood? Brotherhood was a really good sword. What the heck? Why do I have Flame Tongue then? Is it because of the fire? Oh yeah, maybe because there was a battle that I fought against with fire. And that's why I didn't... Okay, whatever. I'll, I'll keep with uh, that, I guess. Maybe because the dragon was like not affected by the water type. Or maybe it was probably the fight that I was going into previously that needed me to do uh, fire damage. Because I actually don't remember... I don't recall exactly what I did to to uh, to need that. All right, let me go and sell the other stuff I don't need. I'll keep the flame tongue for now. Uh, yeah. So let me go and sell not the flame tongue. I'm not gonna sell the muted, but I will sell the metal shield. Yes. The seeker's armlet. Yes. This Seeker's Arm Guard, I guess. Magic Bangles will go away. Although it should have been MP extra, but I don't have any like things for that. Alright, cool. Thank now you. we should be ready to fight for sure this time. Um, although Lulu probably lost some MP, I'm fine with it, I think. A 5% is like... I don't know, like... 2? Or no, like about... Yeah, like two, I would say. It's like about two, like, plus MPs, I think. In terms of math is what I think it is. But anyways, let's get into it. Let's get into the fight with the dragon so we can get on with this game. Um, because I've been wanting to beat this dragon all this time. But I just never had the chance to. Uh, the formation I have up front is Lulu, Eren, and Titus, which I'm going to have to switch out in the battle when I go against this dragon because I heard or I, I saw the video of what I was supposed to do but I think that when I tried it out last time it didn't work for some odd reason like for some reason it didn't work I don't know why like or it wasn't providing me the option to move the ship or Sorry, I paused it. I was trying to skip it because I already saw this. We saw this opening already for a long time. Many times. So the dragon's far away. And. We gotta keep our distance, boys, but we can't let her get too far away! Y'all have to tell me when to move! Sorry if you can hear the, the TV audio because I don't have like a specific headphones for this. So I technically can't play this game without like having to deal with it. This rig ain't so nimble, you hear? Roger, I'll give the commands. Not alone, you won't. So I think that if I recall, Titus gets to give the call. I think. Maneuvering the airship. Use the trigger commands. Move in and pull back to adjust the distance between the airship and. Everett. It is what the name of this dragon is. Only Titus and Riku can give these orders. Yeah, so I didn't catch that command. I didn't catch this specific title. I was confused as all hell. Give an order and Sid will move this airship to the, on his next turn. The cancel an order. Use the cancel command before Sid takes his turn. 
So Sid has a turn, of course. So by all means, I need to pull back. Go back farther. Just. So then I have to actually take the hit. Um. Oh, he has thirty-two thousand. Jesus! No wonder I didn't even see that coming. Okay. So that should deal a bit of damage on him. What does Demi do? One fourth of the health. I don't know if it's gonna take. I don't think it'll be damaged by Demi. Yeah, it's immune to Demi. I, I wasn't sure exactly. So this is where the the fight kicks in that is different. So this is the part where I never got to because I thought I was constantly trying to. Uh, no, I need to switch out to Waka. Because Waka's the only one who can affect the dragon, I think, from afar. Which is weird, because look at that ball, like, fly all the way out there. Oh no. It, oh yeah, it can still hit us, even though from afar. Which is fine. It's totally fine. It takes less. We take less damage from the dragon itself, from being too far from it. Uh, who's this? Aron? I'm gonna switch him out for Kamari, and that's why Kamari was technically leveled for that reasoning, because I can do this. Magic damage. Because the magic damage, by all means, is the only thing that can damage him. Uh, but everything that I hit him with is half the damage, which sucks a little bit. Here we go. This is it. Guided missiles, cool. So yeah, this would, that should damage him a little bit faster. So yeah, that's the one thing I missed out on. Salvo's remaining two. The Photon Spray again. Everyone has enough health to be honest. To survive the fight. So Everyone's gonna have enough health. It's not going to be too much of a, too much of a hassle. Alright. Um... Black magic, Blizzard, I guess. I'll take it. Yeah, Kamari doesn't have good damage from magic, but he kind of does have enough damage to, at least to deal with that kind of thing, I guess. He has 20,000 left. Oof. It's a huge steep hit. Like, I need a lot of hits from, uh, from Waka to actually do well with it. There we go. Okay, so Waka's back again. Once we hit like a thousand health, like if all of us hit a thousand health, then we're good, I guess. Like that's when we will use the, use the potion. Okay, there goes the guided missiles. That should reduce the health by a lot. Salvo's remaining one. What does Salvo's mean? I don't get it. I kind of know. I kind of don't get it. Okay, so we're gonna hit him again. Oh, uh, it probably was... Yeah, I thought it was Waka's turn. I thought it was... Yeah, it, I, I didn't realize it was Kamari's turn, actually. I realized that... Oh! Black magic. Um, actually, can I use her special on Fury? Fire of Fury, I guess. I have to spin the right trigger button, I think it was. Oh, boy. Come on, come on. Oh, it's 6 on that's like 16-ish. Maybe? I don't know. Can't recall. 1353. Man, that ball is like really good. <laughs> that ball really like... Like crazy. Dude. I don't... I think the salvos is coming in. Haste. Oh no. The, oh, salvos means that it, it goes faster. No missiles left. Oh, okay, I see. Totally fine. Oh, and this is where it comes closer to us. Oh, what the heck is this teleported in front of us? <laughs> oh, it missed one of us. Uh, Waka just got hit. I can't give orders because I am playing as Waka, so... The risk here is that I switch over to Titus and call out to pull back. Go back! Just a minute. And then he's gonna hit us. Well, yeah. So Stone Gaze was. So the investment was to give it to uh, to Lulu, which 
she is now officially not gonna have the issue of like she's now gonna have no issues with like stone gaze because I kind of knew that was gonna happen where it was going to attack us some or try to attack us uh who is it what so it's okay, slice and dice or spiral I'll use spiral cut it's not gonna make a difference because there's no enemy besides the spawn. There we go, got it. Here we go. Ugh. That's a huge hit, but that doesn't do much. Don't be falling. <laughs> we don't have missiles, but we do have enough damage from afar. Out of breath range. Oh, it was about to hit us with some poison. Alright, let's switch back to Waka. So this should be it. This should be the final closing kills. Okay, second kill. Sweeping Scythe. Oh no, it's getting closer to hitting all of us, it seems. Yeah, it's trying to get close to it. Alright, I might have to switch Walker back to you. Oh. Uh, because it seems that... Oh, never mind. He's dead. Um, Phoenix down on Waka. Got no choice but to do that. Ooh, it's hitting me. Wait, is that Sid's turn? Oh my god, Sid. Pull back. Yes. Alright, cool. <laughs> I didn't realize it was Sid's turn, actually. <sighs> it has haste, but... I don't know. Overkill. What? It, it hit him and killed him? Oh, we got him! Oh my god. Yeah, this boss was, like, difficult as I thought. I... I swear, I wouldn't have made it out alive if it wasn't like... If I didn't look it up, because I know I was not going to figure it out. I'll never figure it out, but... Thank God I figured it out now. That that was what was supposed to happen. Okay, now we can freaking hit up to the next part of the game. Alright. Nobody- Riku didn't get a level up, so that's the funnier part. <laughs> Everyone got a level up besides Riku. <laughs> oh, we got a, another black- oh, cool, nice. Yes, I needed more black- uh, black magic spheres, because they would give Lulu some upper hand stuff, and maybe even some other characters, but... I think it's mostly useful for certain characters. I don't know if it will give it to Lulu, like, if it will matter if Lulu gets it, but... Oh jeez. Where is it going? Whoa! Never mind, it's going down. Just really fast. Oh, we're holding onto the ship on top of the ship. Why are we on top of the ship? Jeezums. So we're gonna crash land the wedding, it seems. Seymour's not dead, which is awkward. And Yuna's kidnapped, apparently, somehow. We don't know how Yuna got kidnapped, really. Why is... I'm not gonna really shame on it, but I'm kind of curious why her dress is like that. I'm kind of curious. I'm not saying it's bad, it's just kind of weird to me a little bit. Short skirt and really, really high fashion uh, boots or high heels, I guess. <clears throat> I disagree with this wedding, but... God damn it. I think she's hypnotized. I feel like Yuna is hypnotized. It's either that or just that, uh... Yeah, she was brainwashed, hypnotized with one of those things, but... What the hell? There's a bunch of souls coming down. What? Oh, they see us now? Oh, they're sending out people against us. Where's our ship? I'm kind of curious where our ship went. 
Yeah, they can't shoot that down. They're not going to be able to shoot that down either ways, because it's crash landing anyway. Jump off! Titus and the crew jump off and landed there. No! Don't, don't freaking... Don't freaking wed them. Don't wed them at all. <laughs> We're here to cancel the wedding. Oh my. I like how the ship is trying to like land it correctly. Ooh. Yeah, this is so sweet. It's giving me goosebumps. The way this is happening. Oh man, this wedding this wedding crashing is really fantastic. Alright, here we go. Thanks, Sid. Sorry, Sid, and thanks, Sid. Oh, Yuna lost her her little like scarf thing that covers her whole like dress and everything. I'm probably not gonna end the episode, but Yuna! Yeah, because there's no stopping point so far. I don't think there will be a stopping point just yet. Unless there is one. I want to get a stopping point. Ugh. Oh, wait. Oh, no. I forgot. I didn't have... No, I didn't have the, the crew I need. I'm, we're almost all dead, so it sucks. Of one character. I need one that actually heals everybody. Where's the one that heals... Oh, man. Do I not have it? I don't think I have a potion that heals everyone. It heals only one character. Of each. So I need to use a mega potion for everybody. Okay, let's do it. Screw it. Yeah, because I wasn't... I wasn't ready for it. I was like... Okay, let me switch out to Oran because he's gonna kill faster than anybody here. Yeah, these guys are gonna die quickly. I trained my characters way too much, so I know they're not gonna get killed that easily. They'll take too much time. That's almost dead. Is there a... No, they don't have a magic weakness. They only have weakness. Let's see you under pressure. Here we go. There goes that guy. God damn you, bastard. Just go down. You guys aren't strong enough anymore. <laughs> you guys all suck. Yeah, Waka got 0 EXP because, uh... Waka got 0 EXP because he didn't do anything. Like, he didn't damage anybody. I'm gonna use some potion here. Uh, Kamari, gotta get some health. MP, uh... Oh, I should've bought some others. Yeah, I should've got some others. Okay, well, I'll use one of the others. I should buy some others next time. Um, auto... Let me go and power up their spheres, because I do want to get prepared to the fight, be prepared for the fight. Although I shouldn't be, like, worrying too much, but still, they're, they're still useful at the very least, at this point. Like, any any time now it should be useful still. Um, yes, and then use the speed sphere to evade. That would give us better evasion. I also want to use this, but... Black magic node already used by Alan. Teach the ability of drain. No? Maybe not? <laughs> I guess not? No. Uh, Riku, no. She, she didn't get any level ups. Uh, just in case, because I might need to use Waka eventually. But that'll depend. And then Kamari, same thing, move one. So that's good that he was able to get there. Um, because I get to teach him the abilities that he needs for the magic damage, if we ever need it, ever. Alright, cool. Yeah, we can return. Alright, let's do this. I can't save, so I can't- I gotta keep battling until then. It might be an hour episode if I have to push it to that much. What the heck is with this thing? Fire and ice is the one damage that it takes pretty well. He's almost dead. <laughs> Oran got hit in the head like that. Oh my. Oh, what the hell? So it does deal fire damage. Okay. I hope it doesn't have anything like burn damage from like. Okay, well, well, we'll let that happen. Fire ga. Well, oh, that thing's gonna die anyways because fire is really big. And it's overkill, yeah. 
to damage that guy's head. Yeah, Titus is probably gonna get the most damage out of this. It's really weird because of like how these guys deal more damage. Or deals like like all three people's damage or something. It's really weird. Alright, level up. Yeah, somebody had to level up eventually. Lulu is about to level up, it looks like. Alright, let me go and heal up again. Yeah, it's because they're doing like They're doing like all three damage rather than just like one damage, which kinda pisses me off a little bit, but that's whatever the fact is. Alright, let's power up strength. What is the next ability? Delay Buster. Okay. Yes. So the Delay Buster is whatever it is. I'm guessing we're just gonna keep fighting until we... Oh no, I don't want damage on my teammate. Um... Yeah, I wanna get rid of the Fire guy. Strength was almost there, it looks like. Yeah, the, the soldiers with normal bullets seem to damage faster. Oh no, never mind. It's everyone down here. Forget me. Yeah, kill this guy off. Uh, fire guy. No, this person. I want to get rid of like more people, so we can get all the less damage in general. Just get out of here. Enough. Lulu's leveling up. I think it was. Lulu leveled up. The next person to level is both Auron and Titus, it seems. Potion. Yeah, I want to make sure everyone's not dead by the time by the time we fight against whoever it is that we're fighting against. I feel like we're probably going to fight Seymour again. But that's beyond me to understand if that's true or not. Magic goes up, so that's good. Yes. Alright, let's keep going. Uh, yeah, let's go fight. Come on, bring it on. Freaking so much battles, man. There's no end to this fight. No, not flee. Uh, haste. Let's give haste to... Oron. Yeah, because he's gonna probably deal the most damage out of us all. To be honest. God dang it. Bushido? All enemies. Ooh, this is gonna be fun. This I don't know how Bushido works anymore. Fallen. Oh god, I forgot this is like a. Woo! Yes, got it. Damage all of them. Screw you. And then the fire, fire damage, and that should end it. End the battle. Here. I have to use the uh, special ability because I get. I think that I get overwhelmed with like a lot of the fights there. Okay, so yeah, level up for Auron and Titus, so that's good. We got Mega Potion inside of that, so that's also good. Move one, yes. Use a level two sphere. <clears throat> Wait, where is this? Nobody's actually got here. I think this is Yuna's spot. Yeah, we don't have Yuna, so she's not- we don't know if it's hers here. Technically, that's hers, I think. Okay, um, and then Lor Oron- not Loron. Oron goes down for one, yes. Use the evasion. We're gonna get that evasion anyways. So he can dodge more- dodge up more attacks. Yes. And we shall continue. Fighting more and more. I don't like this. I seriously don't like this. I'm constantly still fighting. There's a new enemy type again. Stay right there, Seymour! Stay right there, Seymour! That's one guy down, but... Uh... Oh, enemy's gonna die anyway, so let's kill you off. Wait, what? This guy was on the back? Really? I didn't even know that. This guy's affected by fire. And ice, so I could just kill him off with the magic that Lulu can send. Out. <clears throat> oh wait, no, he's not dead. What? Ooh, that was bad. Yeah. Screw you. That was so random. 
That was super random. Like, seriously, I thought that was like... I thought we were able to like... Wait, what happened? This has gone far enough. Okay. Stop. I don't get it. Why does she have a staff? I'm guessing they probably were gonna wed and then they're gonna use this. What the hell's wrong with you, dude? Stick that thing elsewhere, dude. <coughs> that one priestess is such an asshole. You would play at marriage just for a chance to send me? Your resolve is admirable. All the more fitting to be my lovely wife. This guy is so calm. So confident that he's gonna get her as his wife. F you, Seymour. F you. We killed you once. We're gonna Stop. kill you again. Do you not value your friends' lives? She does. Your actions determine their fate. Protect them, or throw them away. You dick, you douchebag. You old man, stop the. <laughs> God damn it! So what? We send we send Seymour away. So what to you? You know. No, Yuna. No. No. You can't give up yourself. Not like this. You are wise. No! No! We don't want to see the end of this. Yuna, you gotta think about this. It's not going to help anyone. She's marrying a guy because her friends are in trouble. And for the fact that she's too selfish to... No! Oh, no! I'm, I'm so devastated. I'm so pissed. Ah, come on, Yuna. No! Don't do this to us. You dick, Seymour. Kill them. Yep, he's never going to let them go. He was never going to let us go anyways, to begin with. I am sorry, but it is for Yevon. He's shivering. Aren't those this guy's shivering. Forbidden by Yevon? There are exceptions. There are no exceptions. He is shivering. This priest guy is so shivering. Like, the servant is so, like, no! shivering right now. Throw down your weapons. Let them go. Or else. You should send Seymour to... You should send Seymour away anyways. He's not... He's not giving up anyways. Don't throw it. I really want to end this servant's life. I really do. I'm sorry. I'm I'm a bit violent with this, but <laughs> I really don't like this priest. The priest is like, or the the priest or the the servant is Leave like. Now, please. No, we're not that. leaving. Don't worry. Go. This is foolish. If you fall, you'll die. Shut up, Seymour. <laughs> She's not taking a wedding. Don't worry. I can fly. Believe. I'm. <sighs> I guess I'm thoroughly like confused by how this is going to turn out. 
I mean, I understand Seymour's gonna die, but... So now what? I don't I don't get it. Like now what? You know? Like she's officially wedded to Seymour. Cover your eyes. <laughs> Cover your eyes. <laughs> Cover your eyes. And <laughs> And Seymour never gets to see anything. What? What was that? An Our escape plan. Bomb. Let me go. I'm gonna kill that Seymour. Muna said, "Leave. We leave." Yeah, we leave. We'll join up with Come him on. Later. Break through. Ah. Ah. All right. Let's go. I guess. If there's a save point, I can end the episode there. But where'd Muni go? The Bell Palace is Temple. Yuna goes to one place only. Yeah, she has to visit one place only. She just needs to visit one place because that's where she can unlock the last... or second to last or whatever sum summon beast that she hasn't unlocked yet. Oh shoot, how are we gonna get past this area now? It's too quiet. A trap? Who cares? Yuna's waiting for us! Even if Yuna's not here, we can still defeat them. What's a Machina doing in the temple? They're cheating. I suppose it comes in handy. That's not what I mean. The teachings. What about the teachings? Nobody cares, Waka. That's the reason hey, why. Nobody cares me. in this goddamn place. I think the reason behind this is that... Uh, Oh wow, what the heck? It's a freaking <laughs> escalator kind of like styled stairs. It's just like another machina? Man. So this is Yevon's true face. Yep. They betray their own teachings. <sighs> they treated us like dirt. Look, Waka, like look. Just look past it, man. It's not. It's it's just a religious thing. They don't care anymore. They've they've learned to not care about it. And at the same time, they've probably said something about like not being interested in doing like the stuff the without the, me the trials. mecha part of it. I wonder if Uni's really in there. Well, can I Let's save go and at see. least? Let's go. All right. Well, we reached an hour, kind of. So that's a good place to stop so far. Yeah, let's go and save. Alright, thank you guys for watching. Leave a like, comment, subscribe if you guys haven't. Hope to see you guys in the next part or in another video of mine. And hope you guys have a great, amazing day, good night, or whenever you're watching this. I'm a little bit bitter by the fact that goddamn Seymour took a kiss from Yuna with, like, it, it was forced. It's a forced marriage. It wasn't from heart. So I understand that. And I'm happy that it's, like, she was against it to begin with. But she only did it because she was selfish. Well, she was selfish and selfless. She was selfish because she was not listening to her friends earlier on. When the friends told... Like, everyone in the group said, You can do your own way, but just listen to your heart. But Titus knew that he sh she shouldn't have listened to her heart. That he should have. she should have stayed away from Seymour and everything. But Yuna still, in the end kissed him and married him it's considered marriage once you kiss the person it's technically considered even with or without the ring in this game i feel like at the same time like it's also self less because it's to help the friends and help everyone be happy but she needs yuna needs to know you're not going to satisfy everyone you're never going to satisfy everyone everyone has their own interests and goals in life and that you can never satisfy everyone even in real life you cannot satisfy everyone in reality even if you want to like it's great you have that mindset but just know that nobody's ever going to be satisfied ever in my mind is 
applied similarly to this particular part. But anyways, thank you guys for watching. Uh, again, sorry for the long await of Final Fantasy, Final Fantasy X episodes. Now that I've started doing the episode again and that I got past the dragon, I can continue playing this game again and hopefully get up to a certain degree to where I get stuck. Uh, and if I get stuck, I'm going to grind like crazy to make up for the... Uh, make up for the the lost time from battling a particular enemy or boss, whichever it is. Um, but that would only be the reason why I would do it. But other than that, I'm just going to continue on the story and battle whatever I can up to a point where I can't beat the person or boss or whatever it is. But anyways, thank you guys for watching. That's it for me in this part. So, Roz, out.